Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. In the last episode, we were going through uh, the Flying Dutchman's graveyard, and we got pretty much right here to the end where uh, we're gonna have to fight the Flying Dutchman for the last uh, the last golden spatula. See, he won't give it to us otherwise. Last of the tail. Okay. Ooh. Yeah. I forgot about this boss fight entirely. Yeah. Okay. Well, Keep better. hurting the ghost. Oh. Coming faster now. Where are you going? Be like more of the same again. Oh. Yeah, he's coming a little bit faster now, but you know, other than that. And there's four, four uh, lasers instead of uh, four shots. It's three. Come on now. Can we get me? This fight is uh, very, very simple. Actually, the last one for Dutchman's Cairn as well, or uh, Dutchman's Graveyard. Yeah, a Flying Dutchman's Graveyard. Um, yeah. Let me see here. Uh, actually, okay, look. Oh wait, there's one more. What is it? Get a loft, there, matey. Um, hmm. <laughs> well, let's let's go back over here and see see what's going on. I think this probably just takes us back to the very beginning, but let's find out. Uh, yeah, just about. Hmm. hmm. Okay. Let me see. Yeah. Right here. Yeah. Someone better make Ooh, good use of all right these. the shield and everything. Nice. Okay. Um. Well, let's try to fast travel back to that one and see if we can find it. Then, I don't know, I guess we can head into the Chum Bucket. Because um, we're at the point now where it's going to be, like, just kind of the completionist stuff, getting the rest of the spatulas and socks and everything. Well, spatulas from socks and shiny objects, so, yeah. Nope, stop that. Okay, let me see here. Ah, oh, jeez. I forgot about all these robots. we to kill... So I think we probably gotta get to the top of their top of their ship there. It's gonna involve Sandy, one way or another, obviously, but Okay, so that's dealt with. Let's head here. There. Whoa, I hit like an invisible hitbox there or something. Hello. Ow. Dang it. Seriously? Alright, before we continue, let me get oh, up here. Oh, I missed it. Dang it. Nope, too much. 
There we go. Let's go around that. I don't have to worry about it. Yeah. Nice. Alright, come here, you. Boom. Uh, you. Again, like, I feel like I was a little too far away from that to hit me, but whatever. Um, we need Sandy. Oop, wait, wait, wait. Before we do that, we need to lower this. Then we need Sandy. There we go. And now, head across to the other ship. Um, I'm going to use the buttons. Oh my gosh! They don't even work. I swear to God, they don't. Like, the, the, not the buttons, the, um, the things that you're supposed to grab onto, they just don't work. But you have to, sometimes, it's really inconsistent, because sometimes you can be pretty far away and grab them. Other times you have to be right on top of them. Which is really annoying. Alright, let's try that again. And what sucks is if I keep screwing this up, I have to keep coming back here to change characters back to SpongeBob, the bowl, the thing, to go back to Sandy to jump on the thing. It's all craziness. Okay. Here. 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 Stay with it. There we go. And get over here. Um, we need to go that way. Whoa, I didn't have a whole lot of time for that. Oh gosh, can I make it? Nope. Oh, jeez. Great. Well, we know what this means. We're gonna go back over here. Again. Man, oh man. Here, I'm looking now for the golden spatula. I'm not 100% sure where it is or how to get to it. I'm looking around here. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. Go here, go here, go here. Yep. Ooh, nice. Um. this far. I don't see it on the other mast, either. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Well, I could go for the sock, which we're gonna need sooner or later. I guess we'll do that, since we're up here, and then we'll come back and again for the spatula. <gasps> yeah. I did need that. I do not see the golden spatula for this area at all. Oh, hello. Oh, well, there it is. What do you know? I just happened to look over the back side of the ship and see the trampoline there. <laughs> cool. I couldn't see that spatula from the other ship, which is interesting. I grabbed that purple shiny object there as well. The oh yeah, okay, cool. So, that is all of the golden spatulas here. Um, 
Hmm. <laughs> Somewhere there was a sock. I can't remember. What was that here? It was a sock that we needed Sandy for. And it was over here. That's at the end of, like, one of those swing puzzles. <clears throat> Sorry. Nope. Yeah. Now, how in the world are we gonna get Sandy over here? Oh, the things move too? Are you serious? Ugh. Hang on a second. That's the. That's there. This is. Okay. Let's go here. Because I think here there is a uh, character change station nearby. And then we can just basically backtrack into the first area. <laughs> I think that will make our lives. A wee bit easier. Yeah, because we gotta go find somewhere where we can switch characters. So, okay. Huh. Hmm. <laughs> Take out the first one. In here, kill him. Hey, you. Aha, uh -huh, there we go. That's what I need. Need this so that we can go back. And um, yeah, now we're gonna try to get that sock back there. Hope we can not screw that up too bad. I'm missing two health already, which sort of sucks, but I don't think it's gonna end up making a huge difference here. <laughs> There's not a lot of enemies on this side of the. Uh, on this side of the first area. <sighs> okay. Actually, there's no enemies over here. Very nice. Oh my gosh. Now, theoretically, you should be able to hold on to this as long as you need. Like so. Oh, make it on the first try. Yes, nice. I really have to carry Patrick's socks. Cool. Um, as for where the last sock is, I do not remember. Only one more in here. I'm gonna wait up to 35. Hmm. Well, for now, how about we just head back to... Uh, I guess we'll just head back to here. Um, talk to Patrick. Give him these socks. That'll be three more golden spatulas. And then... Hmm... Should we head into the chum bucket? I think we could, we should use the rest of this episode looking for socks because uh, I think the chum bucket starts off like a pretty big boss battle that um, you know can take some time. So I like how they give you SpongeBob around here now exclusively to exclusively to get around the areas faster. That's pretty interesting. So, but I love it. Alright, one, two, and, uh, three. Give me that. Yeah. I think that we only have three more rolled spatulas to go from Patrick. Let's take a look. Uh-huh. Yes. So we need, we're going to end up having 30 more socks, or 25 more socks for a total of 30 by the end of this. So, yeah. Um, I guess we'll head back to Jellyfish Fields then, because that is, um, there's a lot to do there. There's like 14 socks there or something. Yeah, there's, there's quite a few. We got a bunch too. We already got eight, so that's good, but many, many more to grab. In fact, that's six socks out of the 25 we still need. That's just about a quarter of the, of the socks that we still need. That's, uh, that's, that's a lot. Alright, so we know that the one is over there, um, which we can't do anything about yet, because we have to be playing as Patrick. Um, we have to get Patrick and get back over to that Freezy Fruit. Um, I don't really remember where all of the, uh, all of the, uh, socks are, so I'm just gonna start breaking everything. 
because as we've seen in the past, it does help to smash everything, because sometimes, you know, smashing all the tiki's in a given area will give you another sock. So, yeah. yeah. Smash all those. Can I hit them all? No, not quite. Let's put it away, probably, but... There are you. Boom, boom. Oh, 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 where are you going? Jerk. There. Gonna get this. Make sure you're looking like all the goo and everything. Yeah. Oh, wow, he totally took it. Like the boss. Like Stop the, uh, the, the bowling ball cold. Like ah, I couldn't hit it. It was nonsense. Urf. Yeah, here. Like a spring breeze. Um, where does this take me? Just straight like up. Oh, for some health. Good. That's helpful. Boom. Take all those out. Uh oh. Ooh. Ooh, that was close. I'll take those, though. Okay, let's see. Hmm, <laughs> There's a what? There's a blue shiny object up there? Oh, boy. Smack you. You and you. I'll take that. And I'll take all of these tickies. You. And you and you. Just when in doubt, destroy everything. Bam. Uh, oh, hey, I can take these ones out with the old cruise bubble. Apparently, I forgot it has those flash rays. Area of effect damage. Which is nice. Oh, wait. Is that? Hold on. I saw something over here. I saw something. Uh, there's health back there. Oh, we forgot about that little section. Hmm. Pretty sure. Well, because there's a sock in that little alcove that looks the uh, overlooks the bungee, but we got that already, so I don't think we actually need to go back there for anything specific. Oh. Back to that. Boom. And you. Uh, yes, I got a wee, a wee itch. Now, get to those. Um, is this just a straight up jump? Yes. Okay. Eee. Now we already got the one out on the island over there, so that's good. Um, hmm. <laughs> I'll take all of these and ignore you. Watch out for these guys. And get up here and take out these tiki's. We're also going to be getting a whole bunch of shiny objects from this, which is a good thing, because the other way to get golden spatulas is to trade them for shiny objects with Mr. Krabs. Uh, so we're going to need a whole bunch of shiny objects sooner or later. So, this will help us, you know, accomplish that quickly. I could have uh, cruise bubbled this from further away, but didn't think about it. It's alright. Okay, um, these guys out. Hey, Gary. Um, uh, looking around, not seeing anything here. King jellyfish is this way. Here, up here, up here. Goodbye. Uh huh. Uh huh. There. Okay. Um, I know for a fact, right over there, there's a bowling thing that you gotta do. So, that, I, I remember that pretty distinctly. Um, there's another spot, too, where there's a, um, a, a cruise bubble game where you have to, uh, basically just use your cruise bubble to, uh, take out a whole bunch of, f uh, floating tiki's. And I think it gives you a sock for that. So, yeah. Hmm, <laughs> we've already been up there. Well, let's do the bowling thing and see see where we get after that. Fresh, Take that like hill. <laughs> Alright. Dang, I assume you need to strike, right? No, maybe you don't. Okay. Ooh, it's curved. The lane is not straight. Oh, come on now. Yeah. Yay, there we go. Nice. Take that. Nothing else down there. 
Nope. I remember there were some shiny objects over there that you could run over and grab. Yeah. This. Give me these guys. I'll take that purple shiny object that I totally missed somehow. Yeah, those uh, blue jellyfish, they have a lot less time to react to swipe at them. Usually, I mean, they kind of didn't really do anything that time, which is weird, but... Here, here, there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Do, 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 do. Let's just smash all of these guys. Like so. Can't go that way. Hang on. Before I start rushing through this too quickly. No? Okay. Yeah. Get those out. And all of you. Hmm. I wonder if this would work. Probably not. Probably got two of them. I didn't get the other two with this. Not quite. There we go. I don't know, man. Like I said, I'm just trying to destroy all of the CPs. Oh, oh there's a sock up there. Look at that. I don't even know where that is exactly. I'll try to figure out how to get up there. Okay, yeah, interesting. Ah, okay. Gotcha. Piece of cake. Now that we're up here, let's see what we have to do. Oh, jeez. Nope, I missed it. Oh, no, where does that put me? Oh, crap. Oh, boy, I hope that's not too far away. I would like not to look up a guide for this. Oh, good, I'm right here. That's awesome. Um, I prefer not to have to look up a guide for the uh, socks, if I can help it. I'd like to just try to find them. But... I don't honestly remember if I used a guide at all in the original Let's Play. You. Patrick needs to do laundry. I really don't remember, but I wouldn't be surprised if I did, because I bet some of these can be real hard to find, but I genuinely don't remember. Um, so, let's see. We went out that way before, um, and there's not even, like, Tiki sort of smash or anything, so... Or at least not very many. That... Teleport box. Ow! I didn't have a whole lot of time to react to that one. Die you. There's nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. Okay. Smells like. Then we here. Oh, sparkly! Uh, the caves. Okay. Caves already, huh? So we're gonna have to at some point grab Patrick and backtrack a little, which maybe we can do right here at the beginning of the area. Oh no, not yet. Hmm. Well, let's see. Let's see where this slide ends up putting us, because I don't remember exactly. So I think we already went high into the right to get the extra stuff over here, but let's just go check it out real quick. Bam, bam, bam. Because I think there was either a sock or a golden spatula up here. I can't remember. Okay, this is definitely... I remember this area, I just I forgot it was here. Uh, well, the thing said jellyfish caves. So we're like not actually guy. in the caves yet, so yeah. Take you out. Give us for shiny objects on the slit at this point, because we need them. Bam, bam. Here, let's just... Okay, that was not good. Eh. Let's try that again. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh, fine. Jikes. I thought it might be easier to do that, but I guess not. There. Here. There. There. Uh, wait, where's the third one? Oh, that one. I thought I took out the middle one right then. But new. No. Here. 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 Um, we're almost certainly gonna have to start farming shiny objects from something. And right now, I'm thinking that's probably gonna be from the Krusty Krab's uh, dream, uh, Mr. Krab's dream in SpongeBob's dream area. Because um, it just it seems like that's gonna be a good way to get a whole bunch of stuff really quickly. 
Um, because there's so many, not just enemies, but higher level enemies that can be like purple shiny objects for every kill. So that will probably be the map there. So now we're playing as Patrick. Um, is there a teleport box over there? It, it, there is, but it's for the slide. But we do have to backtrack sooner or later here, and if we fast travel, we're going to end up being SpongeBob again, so... Let's backtrack right now. Might as well go get that sock, and then we can just fast travel forward to another, you know, part of the level later on. Come on. Yeah. Can I get back up there? Yes, I can. Good. Okay. Now hop in here. Now we're here. Now we're gonna jump back here. And then once we're through here... Maybe. The loading times I would've thought would be a little bit better, but that's uh, alright. It's not that bad. It's not like we're waiting 30 seconds for the loading screens. The longest is like 10 seconds, maybe. Okay, so we're through there. Um, full on hell, let's run around to the side here and take out, or yeah, grab the freezy fruit and throw it into the, uh, throw it into the goo and grab our sock. Yeah. You actually move forward a little bit when you do that, so maybe it's better to run with that. Whoa, weird little effect on the screen there, over the water, anyways. So I really care about the socks. Shiny objects are secondary. Um, 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 uh, ah. <laughs> oh well, we got the sock, and that sticks, so. As in, we get to keep that, even if even if we die. Okay, cool. Um, how are we doing? Three more. That's what I thought. Okay, let's take a look here. Patrick's dilemma. Spelunking. Uh, let's go back here because I think that there's probably at least one around here that we need to go for. We didn't uh, search this area very thoroughly um, because we were worried about going back. And, well, we were trying to get Patrick and then just run backwards, basically. How many of these do I have to carry? Oh, I missed those floating tiki's there. Ugh, okay, that was weird. We're good. Um, I could go and smash all those again, but eh. Would be a good amount of shiny objects, but we don't need it that badly yet. So, up here, up here, up here, and up here. Hmm, looking around, looking around. This is where I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna start throwing throw fruit at some of these TPs. Just to see. Maybe the game wants me to practice with these or something. Or it didn't uh, want to lock onto it at all. There. And give me this. And go. Alright. Oh, and then there's one back here as well. Yeah. Okay. Nothing there. I'm looking around down below me here. I don't remember if there are any freezy fruits or not. I don't think so. But there could be a sock on a little ledge or something. So, yeah, I'm just kind of looking everywhere right now. Questioning everything. You blow up, and... Ooh, that's not what I wanted to happen. Alright, well. Oh, that just... Dang it, that takes me back up here. Ugh. It's backward progress I didn't need. There we go. I should have guessed it would do that, but I thought it might send me like straight upwards to get some more stuff. That's but much better. Nope. <laughs> There's a shiny object hiding in the grass here. All right. Well, now we're actually into the caves. Do -do 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 -do. Is there a thing in here that we need to be playing as SpongeBob for? I seem to remember that being a thing. Although I don't know, you wouldn't be able to. I don't know if you'd be able to get here as Spongebob, at least not from where we just came from. Because you have to use um, the uh, 
seesaw at some point to boost Patrick over here, which you can't do as SpongeBob. So I don't know. I wouldn't think that would be a thing. Looking around here. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Just sink as you're standing on them, so keep moving. Just looking around. They're trying to be relatively thorough here. Let's jump over here. Uh-oh. 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 Made it. Nothing back there. Get here. I'll take this. I said I'll take this. There you go. Throw that. Ah, oh, whatever. I'll take that health. Hmm. Oh, we gotta... Yeah. Hmm. That's what? That's not what I wanted. Do this, do this. That didn't work at all. That, oh, mm. Well, okay, put it there. Grab it. Over here, stop. Aim, fire. Thank you. Okay, didn't do anything for me. I thought it might, but no. Yeah, you couldn't even get through this area as SpongeBob for, you know, reasons like that. Here, here. Uh, 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 uh. And there, 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 and there, up, and up. Nice. Now, is there a sock on this slide? I don't think so. Let me try to look, though. Up. There. Hmm. No. Okay. Now here's a freezy fruit. I think there is a sock. Well, I think there was a sock, but I'm pretty sure we already got it. Do you want to go for that purple shiny object, though? Because that would be awesome to have. Thank you. Yeah, so there, I think there was a sock over there that we already got. Hmm. <laughs> I knew that we had gotten most of the really obvious ones, so... Oops. Get out of here. Hmm. Take you out. Ow. Jerks. Okay. You. Why is the whistle? Ah. Man. Okay, fine. It'll work. I don't care. Ah, okay. Man, oh man. I'm looking around. I don't see any socks down there or up above or anything. Nope. Okay. Moving on. There is quite a bit more area to go through, actually. And I know exactly where one more sock is. It's the cruise bubble thing that I mentioned before, where you have to hit the floating tiki's in front of you. Okay, we're over here, and we're out of time for this episode, so that will do it for this episode of uh, SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed, and as always, I hope to see you all in the next one.